I know that you're down, just feeling like you can't get up, and I just wanna offer a little bit of love. Now I don't really know what to do, but I hope that singing makes it better for oh, you. Yeah. Hi, yeah. It's been a long, long time. I know since I last recorded an English video. I mean. I'm not even sure if that tunnel was there and that's been there all winter. Right, since I last recorded an English video, a whole winter has passed. Why have I not done an English video? I don't know. To be honest, I've not got a proper excuse, but I've just not done it. Sorry about that. Anyway, what's changed? Everything's grown. It's a lot, lot greener. Here comes the singing makes it better when you've got a broken heart. And singing makes it better when everything's falling apart. Well, if you got the blues, just bust out a tune. The singing makes it better for oh, you. Yeah. The Ancosse Terrace especially has become a lot, lot greener. We've got a whole fence around it, see? So that the donkeys and our new sheep. These are the Wasson sheep, by the way. The smallest sheep on earth. We've even got a baby there called Charlie. But like as I was saying, Uncle Sears Terrace is now our vegetable garden. And you can see plenty of veg and salads and different things growing. And Regis, the kiwi there, is doing so la la. Um, yeah, but the rest's growing nicely. Now I'm just trying to remind you these times aren't forever and your pieces will find and put back together. But for now, here's something to help you get through. Cause singing makes it better for you. So, so, so showed you Rainbow Valley when it was finished and the bar. But you can see we're well into spring. We've got some new terraces started. Donkeys are still with us. There's Monsoon. And further down there, you can see Sunny. Probably from the distance, you can't tell, but she's expecting a new foal any minute now, any day now. She's expecting on to being the dad. That's right, singing makes it better when you've got a broken heart. And singing makes it better when everything's falling apart. Well, if you got the blues, just bust out of tune. Cause singing makes it better for oh, you. Yeah. We've now got some rabbits all hiding down there, though. That's Tokyo. Then we've got Sati. And Spidey, the three rabbits. He's castrated uh, his Spidey, so no babies expected. But we've got some plans with them. And uh, yeah, the manure is like all the other animals, perfect. Because, as you can imagine, veg garden is thriving because of the manure. With us now, well, they've been with us so long now. The goats, uh, the sheep, goats, the sheep, the wasps of the are only tiny. That, um, yeah, they're adorable, they're cuddly as well. They come for cuddles. Yeah. Can you believe we've been at it for two years now? Unbelievable for me. It's still, uh, sometimes get it's still after two years, it's still surreal. Honestly, can't, I can't get my head around it, how the time flies. But yeah, it's all good. But now, and we've just been here two years, the foundation's laid. We know what we want to do, and we know what we can do and where we're going. We've decided it's time to expand. So, this is what I mean with expanding. 
we are open to having new people come live up here and be part of the project. We've got space for you and we can build more houses and buildings. We've got living rights for another nine people and uh, long term we want to be a community, we want to be a village. So if you're interested in coming and living in the mountains of Switzerland, get in touch, get in touch, honestly. Come have a holiday here, stay a bit longer, and you never know, it might end up being your house. We're looking for all kinds of skill sets. Chefs, gardeners, butchers, whatever. We're looking for you. I mean, you don't even need any skill sets, you just need to be a nice person and willing to share. And then, you know, never know. It might be your home soon. When you've got the good juju, share it around. Landwise, we are expanding. There's more land all around that we're allowed to use and graze. So that's why we're also expanding with the animals. Talking of which, I'll just uh, put this egg in the kitchen. And then I'll take you to the goats because we've got some new goats as well. We're up to 13 goats now. We've got, uh, we've got some dwarf goats. We've got some more big ones. We've got some more black necks. We've got, we didn't get any more copper, copper necks, but we've got uh, from the same kind of family, we've got the white ones, the copper sampioni. We got them. Yeah, it's a whole new four. Uh, yeah, so there's 13 of them now. Whew, and what, oh yeah, what, what else we got? We got a lot of mice. I don't know if you've seen the film, Little Big Farm, where it's all about the balance of nature. Yeah, and uh, there where they have uh, lots of animals that they don't want, but it all balances out and everything. Yeah, well, at the moment we're out of balance with the mice. More mice than we actually want and can get, all cats can keep up with. But anyway, we've even got them in the house. Dad is not too pleased about that. I was talking about the house. The other day, the donkeys were in the house. Let me show you the mess he made. Worse than the mess I make. Just pick a little tune, you can sing it out loud. Cause spreading that love is so easy to do. And singing makes it better, oh yeah. I said singing makes it better. I mean, I've got to be honest, it is my own fault. I did leave the door open and they are curious. And there is a whole lot of different things to eat in there than just pure, just plain old grass lying around on the floor. So yeah, I suppose it's all my own fault. Can't be too angry with them. That's right, sing and make it better when you've got a broken heart. See there in the background? Our trees are growing nicely that we planted from the crowdfunding and the bushes. I mean, everything's growing at the moment. Look at that. All over. But, talking of growing, with, with, uh, this winter's been wet. So some walls have fallen down. A lot more damage has occurred. <coughs> The roof of this, this stable has crashed more. It's even destroyed this tree a bit. And yeah, the hole of the ceiling is getting bigger. So that's gonna be our next crowdfunding coming soon. We're gonna try and raise quite a bit of money. Because to fix the stable behind me, to get the walls renovated, and plus pull our Vida, our guest house, to redo the see, uh, the, see, uh, the roof of Pura Vida, that's our guest house, where all the roofers have been staying and our guests. To get it all repaired, because it makes sense to get it all more or less done in one go, because if, if, you, if you've got the guys here for the stable, then it makes sense to have them do the other roof at the same time. Obviously, because it's all helicopters, 
it's all scaffolded in, so you only bring it in once. But yeah, we're looking at a good 250,000 francs we need to raise. But that's life, isn't it? So we're going to try our best to raise it through crowdfunding. And um, yeah, that's what, what else I've got to tell you. Our chickens and cockles have been coming and going. Obviously, see the same old, same old situation with the fox. And this cockle here is, uh, we've named him Ike, as in Ike Turner, because he's a good for nothing cockle. His main activity is going to find Joe's girls. He doesn't look after his own, but he tries to do, follow Joe's girls whenever he can. Whenever Joe's not around, <laughs> he's after them. Good for nothing cockle. Aren't you, Ike? But yeah, that's where he got his name, Ike. Talking of good for nothing, where's our Wurzel here? It's lost his head. He's just recently picked himself back up, but he's been destroyed on the floor. I mean, the season, United season has been good for nothing. Really, I'm just happy I don't get to watch every match anymore it would be depressing good for nothing football team but that's life as well isn't it can't always win let me get a bit nearer to show you and introduce you to the new ladies I said singing makes right. it better. so those are the lads as gizmo that's Krummel and that's Flip. The three lads, they're all castrated dwarf goats, and I got them as a Christmas present for Claudia and Sophia and myself. But they're all just for cute. Those two, that's Jackie and Olga. And then we've got Louis the White Ones, they're Carpe Sabrione. Sophie and Louisa. The copper necks, you know, they've been here for a year now. Look how big that Shakti's getting and Bavari at the back. Proper ladies now, no longer kids. They growing up nicely, they are, the two of them. Well, singing makes it better, even in this crazy weather, yeah. Singing makes it better. Uh, Freya, our first one, you all know her. She's doing well, she's grown. Well, at least her horns have. But yeah, I really love my, I love my goats. Really proud of them, they're good goats these are. We had a couple of issues with them though. Always getting out, but we've got our new self some new electricity. And uh, we graze them, we move them rotationally, grazing them. Every other, well, every four or five days at the moment. But they're doing well. They're doing well. Great goats. But even when they get out, like all winter, they spent out roaming around. But they came back once a week. Never went too far. It's because they all know how, how well they're treated here. Don't you, Valina? But they're beautiful animals, aren't they? Beautiful. As it singing makes it better, well. Singing makes it better, oh yeah. Well, that was it for this quick little update. We've got Woover season has started again. So we're going to be uh, getting a lot more done again this spring. I mean, that's one of the reasons. One of That's an excuse that comes to mind that I uh, didn't do many updates this winter is because I've not done much work. I did also have a rest every now and then. I've been doing a lot of routine things. I've been to school all winter. That's finished again now. But yeah, most of it's just been uh, regenerating my body. <laughs> yeah, winter, winter. That's what it's all about in winter as a farmer, having a rest. Right, so... <laughs> Thanks for watching, thanks for liking. If you've got anything you want to see or know more about, please do comment. 
any questions helps me make content for the next update and i'm going to try to get more regular updates again now in english because i do know you appreciate them and i really really appreciate you watching them thanks a lot and thanks a lot for subscribing and talking about us as well it helps us grow see you later bye bye i say singing makes it better well singing makes it better oh yeah